Yes, marijuana has been decriminalized in New York City, and there are only two licensed shops that can legally sell marijuana products. Now, the sheriff's office has been tasked with making sure unlicensed shops don't sell unregulated product. Today, we expect to uh, get some good hits, hopefully. PIX11 was there as New York City Sheriff Anthony Miranda and his team of deputies raided three smoke shops in Queens. It, it looks like a small location, but obviously we're going to walk out of here with a, a lot of illegal products. This bag probably weighs probably about 30 pounds of flour that's, that's found in here. Deputies also confiscating weapons like this air gun. These store owners are becoming victims of robberies. They are trying to figure out how to arm themselves. This is the improper way of doing it. Many are also selling flavored tobacco and vape products, which are also illegal. Deputies say they discovered some of the contraband in this trap door. These, as you can see, come from Georgia, which means that they are not paying the tax that belongs to the city. So yeah. they are evading taxes. So this is what is endangering our, our children now in our community. We're seeing the packaging, and it's very similar to what the kids eat. The sheriff says his office has done 87 of these types of inspections so far, but he has more than 1,300 left to do. This is the street-level investigation that starts off with hefty fines of up to $50,000. But it continues into a tax investigation to see who's bringing in this product and not paying city and state taxes. Millions of dollars of product have been seized by our office. It tells you the type of turnaround that they have and the type of money that they're making. And this is also revenue that should be benefiting the city that is not. In addition to confiscating the product, the sheriff's office says they're trying to educate these business owners on what they can do and the right way to apply for a license with New York State.